All right, we got to go to the hotline. Big Star. Uh, that's right. Big Star calling in. Robert. Yeah. It's Robert Romanus. How are you? Good. How's it going? Very good. I, uh, I've been very excited uh, that you're going to be on our program. I wish you were coming in uh, instead of just a phone call. Well, where are you anyway? We're in New York. Oh. Where are you? Yeah. Well, I'm in Los Angeles, so... Just waking up. Yes, you bet. Oh, man, it is early, huh? Yeah, go slow, man. Yeah, we'll 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 keep it light. Could you give All us right. could you give us one line so everyone knows who you are? <laughs> one line? Yeah. Well, just to get it going. Act like wherever you are, that's the place to be. <laughs> of course, <laughs> that's who he is. To be. <laughs> Isn't this great? <laughs> Isn't this great? That's who he is. Of course, Damone from Fast Times. You must, dude, every day. Is it every, yeah. every day of your life? Every day. Amazing, yeah. Are you pissed about it? or, or Not at all. No? No, it's actually uh, it's great, you know. <laughs> Isn't it <this> great? <laughs> <laughs> of course it is. Uh, uh, now, yeah, i got to get through some of the basic questions you probably asked all the time and everything. Did, uh, w did you expect it to be that big uh, a movie that just has uh, mm. gone on for this many years? And no, never did, never did, never, never in my wildest dreams imagined that uh, you know twenty something years later I'd still be doing interviews about it. <laughs> yeah, you know it was like a summer movie. Well, we still watch it on a regular basis. That's quite amazing. Yeah. Do, you, do you ever think uh, Penn would, back then would win an Oscar? Yeah, I knew he would. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> he's an amazing actor, you know. Yeah, uh, uh, what do you what do you think about his um, you know, politics and stuff? You ever get involved with any of that? Or? Well, you know, personally, I don't get involved. Uh, Good I do move. I, I do what I do, you know. But uh, yeah, I, just, I love Sean Penn, man. I think uh, I just love what he does. Yeah, you know, he's I was. Got, uh, he's got a great commitment, and uh, and I love that. And he has it in his work, and he has it in his life, and. Uh, how can you not like that, you know? Even if you don't get along with it. Yeah. You ever bump in anybody from uh, the movie? Once in a while. You know, maybe, uh, I think it was a couple years ago, we did a photo, a cast photo. For, really? Uh, for, uh, what's that magazine? <laughs> Vanity Fair usually yeah, does that's those. It, yeah, that's it, yeah. And that was, you know, we saw everybody. It was really fun, but uh, that's about it. Everybody's so busy, you know. Yeah. Hey, you had full frontal nudity in that movie that they didn't show, huh? You bet. Yeah, yes, they, I did. They, and uh, they had to cut it out uh, to keep an R rating? Well, you know, I think it was a toss-up. Honestly, I, I don't really know, but I think it was between, you know, they looked at the carrot scene, you know. Right, the blowjob they, scene, yeah. Yeah, sure. and they looked at our scene, and they said, something's got to go. Oh, you can't no. Have both. That isn't what they just told you because it didn't end up very good. Did you, were you proud of your full frontal? Because there's some guys they do the full frontal and it's like, uh, uh maybe they shouldn't have done that. Yeah, let me tell you, I have nothing to be shy about. Oh, oh there you go. <laughs> <laughs> I got the most important question though. <clears throat> All right. Why did he screw up and play cashmere in the car? Oh, well, you that know that's right. a that's a question I get asked quite often. That's probably the number one question because what's the yeah. famous line when it comes to making out? Put on side one of Led Zeppelin four, is it? Side <laughs> yeah. one of Led Zeppelin four. Yeah, yeah. Okay. And, uh, then, and then they cut to the scene. He's in the car, and it's cashmere. Right. Well, on. I'm gonna guess. I'm gonna guess what happened is uh, it had to do with the rights. Yeah. Yeah. I like to just think Rat was so stupid. Right. That, well, you uh, could think that if you like, you know. Yeah, he just couldn't quite get a grasp on what you were trying to do. You know. Oh, well, you know, you can't go wrong with cashmere either. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't this great? Yeah. <laughs> what are you working on now? You got a, a movie? Well, uh, yeah, I got a couple things. You know, I I teach mostly, you know. I work with kids from kindergarten through sixth grade. What do you teach them? I teach uh, uh, music and drama. Really? Yeah. And... Uh, and, uh, you know, every once in a while I'll go off and do a movie, you know, if uh, I get a call from a friend or something. And uh, in the theaters now is a movie called Going Shopping. Uh, that's a Henry Jaglum <coughs> film. Mm -hmm. 
But there's another movie that I just finished called uh, The Mojave uh, Desert Phone Booth, which I think is going to be really good. Yeah. What's that uh, about? Well, you know, there's an actual phone booth in the Mojave Desert that's like 15 miles from nowhere, and it's famous. There's a whole website about yep. it and everything. And, uh, and for years, people would drive out to this phone booth, and people would call this phone booth. And so strangers would talk to each other. Can I ask you a question, uh, yeah. Robert? It, now, are you a teacher and all this stuff? Uh, are you, is it this forced to tri Like, are you forced to be this caring guy, or, or just didn't? Or you know, it didn't happen. Like kind of Patrice O'Neill, by the way. Don't Maybe, tell him who it is. Cause may have just, seen him in some motion know, pictures. Like, it's like because when the people go, he plays the bouncer a lot. Like yeah. from right, I'm a big black dude, and it's like <laughs> if I ever say that I'm teaching kids, uh, most likely something you know didn't work out for me. Well, I don't understand that question really. Are you teaching yeah. because you have to? Or teaching because, you know, you want to. Well, That's let a good me tell question. you something. I, I don't know any teacher, really, who teaches for the money. <laughs> yeah, right? Yeah, no one, they don't make any money. You know? <laughs> I mean, if I wanted to make money or something, I'd, ha I'd really have to do something else. And I in think fact, In fact, I, I act to supplement my income yeah. as, a, as a teacher. I see his resume is a little more full than yours, Patrice. Yeah, I so know. So how about... Uh, I enjoyed him in Kill World. I, I don't here. know what you're insinuating. Oh, well, let me, let me, I didn't let see me you in that. Valerie Flake. I did. Patrice. I've done this for almost, I think almost uh, like 25, 30 years I've been doing this, you know. Yeah. And after a while, you know, I get tired of going into these offices and oh, yeah. and trying to prove to these people in five minutes that I'm the guy for the job. Yeah, that's but, what I'm talking about. I mean, about. after 20 years of film, I got 20 fucking years of film. That's right, you. Patrice. If you haven't bought me by now, yeah. you're not going to buy me in a five-minute meeting. What role were you in, Maggie Winters, Patrice? I wasn't. I, that's what I'm saying. I just want to make sure. Patrice did play a transvestite in uh, the Meg Ryan movie. Which one? I was the movie? In the cut. In the oh, cut. Yeah. Yeah, All right, now, we don't don't get down on Patrice, man. He's asking. He's got a, a legitimate question. Yeah, I just wanted to know. That's No, all. I wasn't getting down. He actually played a transvestite role. And, uh, and what part did you play in that Secret Sunday, Patrice? Nothing. I'll tell you how I got oh. into it. And I also and wasn't in Tigers. Uh, yeah? I have three kids. Really? I have three kids. I got 10-year-old twins and a 7-year-old. And I spent a lot of time with my kids, and I spent a lot of time at their school. And it just boring. such a, a much more uh, enjoyable atmosphere for me, you know, yeah. than the hustle of showbiz. Yeah. So that's really where it comes out. I mean, I'm, I, I'm not a young kid anymore. If I was a young kid, I, I wouldn't be doing this. Yeah. I'd how, still be hustling, you know. How old were you when you did Fast Times? I was 26 years old. 26, playing yeah. like a high school kid. Exactly. Yeah. Who's laughing back there now? Uh, Patrice just Patrice fell on down. the floor. <laughs> he can't what, get up. The guy's six four. He's a six four black guy. He's laying and on he's the floor. He's falling down. And he's and he's got to hit his life call button around his neck so somebody could get in here and lift him back on the chair. I, I'm sorry, Robert. <laughs> he fell off his chair for some reason. I don't know why. <laughs> now you have uh, you have a brother in showbiz. Yeah, I have an older brother. Yeah. And was he? Did he guest in The Sopranos? <laughs> Yes, he did, yeah. Because a lot of people thought that was you. No, he's a lot taller. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Yeah, I didn't know. Uh, and older. I mean, he's like 13 years older than me. Oh, yes, because people are saying, oh, he was in The Sopranos. No, no, no. Oh, no, that wasn't him. Brother. Oh, get it he right. Was in, uh, he's been going since Mean Streets back in the 70s, you know. Right. Uh, hey, why didn't you take a sip of that iced tea before you said great iced tea? <laughs> 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 I think that was planned. Yeah, great ice tea because it wasn't all about the ice tea, was it? It wasn't. That's it wasn't right. At all. I got a very, very uh, important question. Do you got a pair of tickets for you two this Friday night at Madison Square Garden? Oh, uh, I wish. I need tickets for you two. You can't get tickets. No. I'm almost working at the Seven <laughs> Eleven. <laughs> all right, Robert. Well, thanks for. Uh, Thanks for calling up, man. Moha right. Mojave Phone Booth, uh, yep. coming out in 2006. Yeah, exactly, man. All right. All right. Well, good luck to you. Thanks, uh, thank man. Thank you, Robert. Bye. Bye. There he goes. God Patrice. <laughs> Jesus.
I started brewing in him till he couldn't help himself. Patrice <laughs> and Obi naming his movies. <laughs> I didn't see you in, and I'm Valerie Flake. Let me tell you something. These about were real movies, by the way. Let me tell you something about Tychus. I don't know what you played in Valerie Flake. <laughs> Listen, uh, let me tell you something. Carlos Wake, buddy. <laughs> Classic. You know, Patrice, he was executive number two in Bachelor Man. <laughs> Who were you? Who were you? Steven's boss in the last run. Oh, Were you geez. in Shut Your Dirty Little Mouth? It's just like you would just love to hear the honesty. I would be so honest if it was like everyone in a movie that I was in is a, is like a name brand. Even Phoebe Cates. Uh, yeah. Phoebe Cates, Judge right. Reinhold, uh -huh. Sean Penn, yep. Jennifer Jason Lee. Yeah. And then he's the second most unknown other than the dude who played the guy trying to sleep with Jennifer Jason Lee. <laughs> Uh, the uh, the uh, stereo salesman. What was that? What finally got you? It just. <laughs> you didn't see him. He was just staring at me the whole time. Like, are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> All right, students, settle down. Oh, Opie caught me. You really caught me uh, on guard with that. Like a boring man. Oh, yes. That My name. That he couldn't hear. He's like, oh. He's, he's, he's stammered. He's stammered like, what I'm your that? drama I teacher. Didn't, I didn't just hear what I thought I heard. I'm your drama teacher, Mr. Romanus. <laughs> settle down, kids. <laughs> <laughs> hey, kid, would you get that shirt out of the hamper? She basically said, do you, do you like working with kids, or do you do it because you're a failure? I just figured I'd help kids out with their math homework on such a hot day. <laughs> hey, nice car, Patrice. You're keeping it up well. <laughs> <laughs> and don't fuck with it. <laughs> hey, don't. Ah! Bigger! Go, 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 go. <laughs> That's a damn good one. Oh, shit. Two tickets for Patrice, Earth, Wind, and Fire, and Little Brother. <laughs> oh, man. 